Whoop, whoop, whoop. Wait up. Hi, and welcome back. It has been a while. As you know or not know, like many others, I started playing video games when I was very, very freaking young, playing with the Atari 2600 and now playing on the PS5. I am now 36 and I do feel it's, it's time to move on. And as you can see, I already got rid of my video games. I just feel that I have done it all. I have seen it all. I have played it all. There's not really much to do in the world of video games. Actually, I'm shitting. Of course, I'm still playing video games, you idiots. <laughs> I actually bought a new house. Um, I'm not moving right now, but they, they are going to make pictures of the house for because this house has to be sold. And uh, it's quite weird, but um, all these video games are not allowed on the pictures. And it really depends on how fast my house is going to be sold. So I could be here for another three to six months. I'll be here for three to six months in a pretty empty house it's uh, pretty boring but it's very exciting and the other house that i bought holy shit that house is bigger it's modern it's super sharp it's a lot bigger it's, it's 40 square meters bigger 40 than i have uh, in in dutch in netherlands 40 vierkante meter so uh, i'm really happy um, you know, I, I've, I've been here in this house for 11 years. I have a lot of memories here, a lot of good memories, also a lot of bad memories, but a lot of good memories. You know, I, you know, complete PlayStation 4 generation, I played it in, in this house. You know, the PlayStation 5, I played it in this freaking house. Uh, talking about the PS5, by the way, I played the Final Fantasy. 16 demo and what do i think about it uh, it's fine i mean let's be honest if that game would have been called dragon age everyone would believe it's a dragon age game it to me personally you know i i've played the demo and it's it's the storyline is very interesting the characters are fine the music is great the battle system is not better than the remake of 7, but better than Final Fantasy 15. I don't know why they just didn't use sort of the battle system of like Final Fantasy 12 or like Final Fantasy 15. Um, it feels, and this is something that a lot of people have said, it's, it feels like sort of like a devil may cry. Like it feels like the enemies have too many hit points and you need to do a lot of combos, or at least it feels like you're doing combos. But the battle system is more engaging than Final Fantasy XV. Graphically, it looks outstanding. It looks beautiful, especially the part in uh, Rosaria where you're in the castle. Really, really good looking game. And I actually have read that the game only has a 300 megabyte day one patch. I mean, kudos to Square Enix to actually make and finish a game that does not need 40 gigabytes of fucking patches. However, as I mentioned before, to me personally, my personal view, it does not even look like a Japanese made RPG. It is, don't get me wrong, it is of course on Square Enix, but it does feel like it's catering a lot for the Western, younger Western audiences and, and not the sort of people like me, I guess, who grew up with Final Fantasy VII, VIII, IX, VI, maybe even, five, four, whatever. Actually, I also played one, two, and three. I don't, I didn't, I didn't play six, but these, these six is three in Japan, right? I don't know, it's weird. Um, <laughs> but um, to me, you know, if this game was called Dragon Age, I would completely believe it. it would be like, holy shit, look how good it looks. To me personally, it does not look like what I want or, or what I think is a Japanese style RPG. Tales of is sort of what, to me personally, is like, that's some Japanese RPG. If you, Tales of Arise, 
looks Japanese. It plays Japanese. It looks Japanese. But this is my opinion. Because someone else would, would probably say, Hey, Claude, you little fucking boomer. You know, go play Final Fantasy VII then. Go play... Well, actually, I am playing Final Fantasy VII. And it's a lot better than a demo of uh, Final Fantasy uh, XVI. Will I get the game? Well, as I mentioned before, I just bought a new house. So I have to buy, you know, new supplies and new supplies and new stuff, new bed, new... Uh, I'm gonna butcher the name, refrigerator. Um, so, you know, I'm, I'm kind of slowing down on buying video games. I did buy one though. I did buy one, wait up. I got Shadow Hearts, finally. Got, uh, I got it for 59 bucks. I think that's a pretty good deal. And um, I actually played it for about seven hours. And I actually like it a lot. It's a really cool RPG, pretty dark. Um, I'm not entirely sure if it's if I can say this, but I don't give a fuck. But basically, in the first 20 minutes, this guy wanted to sort of grope this girl two times. He was thinking about doing it. I'm like, what? <laughs> if something like that would be in a video game in this day and age, <laughs> it would be cancelled. <laughs> Definitely it would. So um, yeah, leave in the comments below. How are you do guys doing? What have you been playing? Are you going to get Final Fantasy 16? What did you think about the demo of Final Fantasy 16? And if I forgot to tell you, the storyline was very interesting. Very interesting. I think that especially the way they ended the demo, I was really on my seat like, oh, what was gonna happen next? And then you see like, you know, thank you for playing. I'm like, no, I want to, I wanted to know more. I wanted to keep playing. You know, don't get me wrong. I, I think I've said only bad things about the game. The storyline was really interesting. Um, and the whole dark settings, again, that's a sort of why, um, in my personal opinion, you know, it's not really what Final Fantasy was. I'm not going to say what Final Fantasy is because I'm not a... I, I didn't invent Final Fantasy. I didn't make Final Fantasy. So, you know, I'm not allowed to say this is Final Fantasy. But in my personal opinion, it's not what Final Fantasy was back in the day. Um, so leave it in the comments below. Like, share, comment and subscribe. Like always, you're going to see me next time.